and this week on the new normal we are doing shopping videos so for this theme I decided to do a challenge that I don't know if it's already a challenge or if I made it myself or what, I don't know but I'm going to be doing a shopping challenge so basically I have three types of outfits and three different amounts of monies and basically what I have to do is with that amount of money pick out that outfit and buy it and see how good I can make it if that makes sense if it doesn't you'll get it as we go along so the first thing I'm going to be doing is choosing how much money I'm going to be spending on each outfit so I'm using this spinny thing online the first outfit is this one fall or autumn outfit you know keeping it continental with the fall or autumn so we're going to spin the spinner Okay, £10. So I have £10 to spend on an outfit that is fall slash autumn which is probably going to be quite a challenge. Definitely going to be a challenge. Okay, next I've got outfit for school. So an outfit that would be good to wear to school. Yeah, that one's going to get... Oh, oh, whoa. Oh, here we go. So I have £25 to spend on a school outfit, which means the only remaining one is a party outfit and I will have £50 to spend on a party ready outfit. <laughs> so now that I've picked out the outfits and how much I'm going to be spending on each of the outfits, it's time to go shopping, get some clothes to rock these outfits. I just got back from my shopping trip. I've made my purchases. Some of them were way harder than others, but I will get onto that now. So I'm gonna let go. Yeah. So the most easy one was by far the £50 limit. I just went to Urban Outfitters. And it was the party outfit. So I tried on a few things, but the eventual one that I chose was this red dress and honestly so cute it's like I think it's called an A-line dress but it's kind of body calm but kind of not I don't know but it's really cute and I love it this was £42 so it was under the limit so I got these earrings as well um, which I love very much and yeah it looks so cute and obviously like not every outfit you buy could be £50 because it's expensive but it is really cute so <laughs> love that love that for me <laughs> The next outfit was the £25 outfit and that was the school outfit which could be worn to school and I'm going off it being like college or like a school where you don't have a uniform because they don't want to wear a uniform because that's weird. This outfit I love so much like I would wear it for not school as well like you could definitely dress it up or down so the outfit is this um, top which is kind of like a mustard colour long sleeved so nice from New Look and this was £8.99, love that. And then also, this I, I vibe so much, it's kind of edgy, <laughs> kind of edgy, like kind of have an edge to it, you know? But it's this jumpsuit, you kind of can't see, but it's got like wide legs and then it's got like this kind of top and it's so cute. And this was, I think, in the sale. I'm pretty sure this was £8, like, maybe it was 10 or 13 Okay, this was either £8 or £10 or £13, but 
it's really cute so whatever it was it's definitely worth it and I got an age 11 in this which is six years younger than my actual age but you know we have to go with the flow and then just because I hadn't quite spent the £25 and I thought what could I add to this outfit I bought some frilly socks from Topshop they're like I don't know they have this kind of thing but it's so cute so I thought they would go real cute with some shoes I'm not sure what shoes yet but you'll see that one I'll make sure you together so that was outfit number two Okay, the outfit that was £10 limit and it was the fall autumn kind of outfit was by far the hardest because well, £10 is like not that much for a whole outfit and it was just really hard because all of the stuff that was on sale racks that was actually cheap enough was summer stuff and the whole thing was fall. So, I'll show you what I got. I think I did okay with it considering it was only £10. Um, the first thing I got was an absolute steal, <laughs> like, wow! Okay, so, it's this top from New Look, uh, it's like a tank top, and I think the colours are quite full autumn -y, cause they're like browns, which is autumn-like. And, okay, let me tell you, this, okay, it said on the thing, it was originally supposed to be £8, and it was reduced to 4 so I was like, woo! So I go to the checkout, I'm like, yeah, I've got my £4 ready, I'm ready to pay, and she's like, oh, this is actually part of our, like, something-something offer, so instead of being this much, it's actually £2, and I'm like, oh my god, that's crazy, and then she added this other discount on, and this nice top was £1.60. And then for that I also got this little cardigan from Primark and it was £6. Great cardi. It's quite nice and good for the fall because you don't want to be cold. You don't want to be chilly. And then finally I got some leggings. These were from Primark as well because I couldn't, like the jeans were all too expensive. So we went leggings. That's, that's, that's what we did. We got leggings. And then navy blue, which honestly I haven't worn like normal leggings in about 12 and a half years, so this is going to be exciting. So those were my outfits that I picked out and hopefully they fit the theme. I think that I passed this challenge or succeeded or whatever, but comment down below what you think. And comment down below which of the three outfits, the school outfit, the party outfit or the autumn outfit, the full one, which one would you most want to spend the £50 on? Because I'm pretty happy it landed on party, but any of them would have been amazing. Anyway, so yeah, comment that down below. That is everything for this video, so make sure you subscribe to the new normal channel and give this video a thumbs up because I'd like that a lot. Also, remember to check out my main channel, Ellie Louise. As always, there'll be a link at the end of the video for my channel, for this channel, for something else, probably, maybe, probably not. So yeah, I think that's pretty much everything. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next week here on The New Normal. Bye!